Hi, and welcome back to Master Slider free version video tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a controller to your slider. First of all, I click on the name of the slider. And then I choose the slider controls tab. In the slider controls section, I have a list of controllers available that I can add any of them using the add new control button. As you can see, I have added the arrows, then I add thumbnail lists, and then I add bullets. I click on the preview to see how my controls appear on my slider. As you can see, thumbnail lists appear at the bottom of my slider, and arrow and bullets have been added to my slider. To make changes in the controller, you could simply click on the controller and from the bottom section you could make the required changes. For instance, I change the align of the thumbnail list from bottom to right. And I change the space between the tabs from 5 pixels to 2 pixels. As you can see here, my thumbnail lists have moved from the bottom section to the right section. I could also add the line timer and the circle timer. And other controllers, according to what I need. I click on preview. As you can see, the line timer has appeared at the bottom of the slider and the circle timer has been added to the top left corner. I remove the circle timer and I change the position of the line timer from bottom to top. And I could also change the color of the timeliner. Here I choose red. As you can see, the line timer has moved to the top section with the red color. Regarding your needs, you could make any changes or alterations required in the control settings and customize the slider to meet your needs. In the end, I click on save changes to save my settings. Okay, we're all set. If you encountered any issues, please don't hesitate to contact us. Thank you.